My name is Ian Berg. This is my 365 project. So it's day 142, uh, and <clears throat> uh, YouTube has been having some weird issues. I don't really understand. I've uh, tried uploading my videos, and there's really weird stuff happening on the upload page. That's part of the reason why Friday and Saturday's video didn't get uploaded loaded today. Uh, the other part was I just didn't really feel like it. Um, but yeah, I did still make the videos on those days, so you can't get in trouble. Can't get mad at me for breaking any rules. Plus, I wrote the rules, so suck it. But yes, um, so today has been an interesting day. Uh, watching those those videos of Remy back on Friday uh, kind of intrigues me and concerns me. I know he wasn't really doing it to like make fun of me, but it concerns me that that's how Remy and uh, and Jenny perceive me and see me on a daily basis coming into their office. So yeah. I guess I'm just a source of laughter for them on a daily basis. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. But yeah, um, today I got uh, a virtual slap in the face on, on Facebook. And I'm not going into any, any specific details or anything, but I just want to talk about your online presence and how whenever you write something online, it's, it, it should be common knowledge. Most people don't actually really think about it, though. Uh, working with the EBM people at uh, at VFS, we talk about it all the time. You write something online, doesn't matter if you delete it right away, it's there forever, and it can always be found in some way. So that online presence is just really vital to your your character and who you are. And then that whole online bullying thing, I kind of felt online bullied today. And I know most of you are like, bullied, oh, I do. didn't happen since like junior high or high school or whatever. Fuck you. I'm sorry to say that, but fuck you. Online bullying happens even at my age. And if you think I'm a pussy for saying that, well, screw you again. Um, harsh comments can be said, even if they are meant to be nice and easy and like just a joke or whatever. But you re remember back to your younger years, at least for me, uh, when I got bullied in, in junior high, high school, all that. Uh, when when we confronted the bullies, when, if the if the parents or the the teachers or whatever confronted the bullies, they'd be like, "Oh, well, we were just joking around." That's a good easy front getting out of it, but that's complete and total bullshit, and I hate that. So even even at this age, somebody says, "Oh, well, we were just joking around." It's just how you thought you saw it or how you perceived it. Well, screw you. You have to, as an adult, have the guts have this knowledge, have the wisdom to think about how whatever you say, whether it's in person or online, whatever you say is actually how that affects the people. So even if you don't mean any offense whatsoever, you got to think about how it's going to affect the people because you will affect people with what you say. and. If you just throw things out there and don't even think about the consequences, well, that's just not cool. That's not adult. That's not responsible. That's not respectful of the people. And I think that it's that's a huge thing because people, especially with this online thing, everybody can just oh, nobody cares. Nobody, there's no consequences. Who cares? Nobody cares what what's gonna ha happen or what's gonna be said. But it affects people. And even if you're just joking around, it doesn't matter. Some people can be offended by it. Some people can be slapped in the face virtually like I did so today so yeah that's my rant on uh, social media and online presence and being responsible with what you say so next time you write a status update or a comment or anything online basically anything you post videos anything whatever just just be sensible and think about how it's gonna affect the people that are going to be getting that content because it can it can affect people a lot. It my whole afternoon got ruined just because one person made a stupid comment, and it shouldn't be that way. I wish it didn't affect me like that, but I can't decide how things are gonna affect me. I can decide how I'm going to react to that. Uh, how going to how I react to the what the what the thing affected me was, but I can't decide that I'm not gonna be affected by it. That's just 
bullshit unless you're you're just lying to yourself if that's the case. But here that I've ranted for five minutes straight, I'm going to let you go. It's been a while since I've got, gotten a good rant out, so you have a good day. I will see you tomorrow. And cheers.